Hello friends, my name is Amit and I welcome you to my YouTube channel Voice Card. So today we will see how you can configure the authorization code and how it works. So let's start and go to the web page of our call manager. So open it and yes, here is the web page of our call manager. So first thing we need to go to the web page inside the call manager by entering our credentials yes now enter and also one thing let me let me open the Cisco IP communicator now open uh, I'll show you try to call a mobile number uh, through this IP communicator and we'll see that we can we can call the number we are dialing without any code it is asking so now dial so now we can see we are able to dial the number so now uh, we, we need to go to the root pattern here we can we can see that uh, the the exact code we are dialing to dial that particular number so here it is the code 9011 followed by the pound key and has key so this pattern we are dialing and into this pattern we we can see that the uh, authorization code uh, option is also there so there you can see this yes and authorization level is zero here so click on save and now we need to go to the force authorization code tab uh, so you can see we, we didn't configure anything then click on add new uh, any name you want to give you can give it over here and uh, the code you likes you can enter let's example one two three four and the level will will take is zero at start and click on save now try to call that number again here we go it is asking for the authorization code so here we need to put that authorization code and after that we are able to call the number so this is how authorization code works and how the authorization level works like if we uh, change it to 0 to 1 still we are able to dial that number because in our root patterns we mentioned is at 0 so 0 allow all uh, so anything you give zero and above zero it will pass the call but let's go inside the root pattern again and we'll change that code from zero to one zero to one click on save go back to the authorization code tab open it and if you change it as like zero you you are not able to call that number because your la authorization level is zero but in root pattern it's mentioned as one so I'll show you yes now it is not allowing us to call that number but if you change that level from zero to one or two or three or any number let me show you like for example one or two or three and anything above zero let's take it as one now try to call that number again enter the code and yes now we are able to dial that number so this is how authorization code works Thanks for giving time to my videos friends please like and subscribe and press the bell icon for the latest notifications and if you have any queries related to the videos please do comment in the comment box we'll come up with the solutions thank you